All right, let's talk about how to make a very simple accordion menu on XD. So if we look at this, I have a component that has a default state and an open state. When I click on the component in its default state, I added an interaction that will auto animate to open. Then when I switch to the open state, I added an interaction that will send it back to the default state. And let's see how I made the actual component. Uh, let's just start from the beginning. So I grabbed my rectangle and I made a rectangle. I grabbed my type tool and I typed accordion. Hopefully I spelled it right. And then I switched back to my mouse tool and I put it here. Maybe make it a little bigger. I don't know. I can center it. Uh, you could add a fancy little graphic that shows you that it's open and closed, um, but we're not going to right now. So this I'm going to make into a component. I'm going to press Command or Control K or click plus or right click. And um, it's going to have its default state. And I'm going to add a new state called open. When it's open, I'm just going to have the back be gray. So again, we just want to get an idea of how this works. There we go. Now let's add. There we go. Now let's add the text. It's going to be another rectangle that is the same width as the tab. And then I will draw a text box in here and paste some text in here. All right. Draw a text box and command or control B. I'm going to take it down to, I don't know, 30. That's a little small. There we go. And I grab my mouse tool, get it here. Now, what I want this space here to be similar in size because I actually want it to be behind it. Um, I'm going to select this and move it to the front. There we go. That's better. So I'll move the text box there, or the background box, and put the text here. So now I'm going to select the rectangle and the text and turn those into a component. And maybe I'll name them over here in my layers here. Tab, body. So on my body, I want to add a minimized or closed state. I'm just going to call it mini. When it's minimized, the text is up here, hiding behind the tab. And I'll shrink its box so it's completely gone. And the background is also the same size as the box. So now if I click on Body, I have default, mini, accordion, I have open, default. So now what I want to do is put both of them into another component. So we're, we're nesting here. And if I do this, I select everything, and I'm going to add component, default state, and then I will add a new state open. Notice I'm not using a toggle or hover state because those have built-in interactions. Already. So when it's open, I can double click here. I want the tab to be in its open state and I want the body to be in its default state. So if we go back to this component, default, open. Prototype, when it's in default, there we go. Default state, I want when it gets clicked, a tap, I want to auto animate to its open state. And when it's in its open state, I want to add an interaction that when you tap, it goes back to default. So if we play this, we have a pretty simple accordion. Now let's see how we can make this work with multiple accordions. So I'm going to undo a tiny bit. Um, that should be. Nope. I'm going to undo to where they're not in a shared component. Almost there. There we go. So I have tab and body again. And what I'm going to do is just group them. Command or Control G. And I'm going to copy. I'm holding Alt or Option. And now what I'm going to do is select all of these. 
put them in a group again and give them a stack. And this is going to push them out of the way when the accordion opens. So now this group, which I think I might have had too many, but that's okay. Um, I'll turn that into a component, and I would have a state for accordion 1 open, accordion 2 open, accordion 3, and then I'd have default. So let's go ahead and do that. New state, 1 open, and I'll go over here, and group 1. When this isn't open, the tab is open, and the body, here comes some magic, is default. Pretty good. Uh, and now let's go back to component. We should see default one open. And I'm going to make this artboard. Oops. A size that uh, makes sense. I'm having a struggle here. Since we're just demoing. All right. Let's go back to our component. So it has default. Now let's add to open plus new to open. And this time I'll go to accordion two. And when it's open, tab is set to open, body is default. And then we'll do it one more time. We'll add new state three open. And one more time here, tab is open, body is default. So, ooh, but I made a mistake. Uh, I left the middle one open, so let's just go ahead and put that one that it should be closed. Otherwise, they won't close when you change them. So we have default one, two, three. Pretty good. Let's go to prototype. So when it's in default, I double click on first one and tell it to go to one open. Double click on two, go to to open, double click on three, grab that, and go to, you gotta click purposefully here, click to deep, you end up in the wrong one, three open. And then when this is in one open, clicking it again, goes back to default. When it's in two open, clicking it again, goes back to default. When it's in three, clicking it again, goes back to default. Let's see if it actually works. <laughs> we'll hit play. Accordion 1, accordion 2, accordion 3. Pretty cool.